Yeah, Zach and Evan, this standoff lasted almost six hours, and you can see behind me the SWAT teams had to bust in the back glass of this patrol car here behind me where there was a woman barricaded inside with a rifle in her hands. Now, if you're just tuning in for the first time tonight, here's how this all started. We're told Grady County deputies did a welfare check near County Street 2960 and Quail Haven Road. Now, deputies detained a woman who Oklahoma Highway Patrol says became violent, but then she somehow got out of her handcuffs and barricaded herself in a Grady County squad car. We know one deputy and a civilian were both shot. We know the deputy has non-life threatening injuries, but we still have not heard the condition of that civilian. Now, in the last hour and a half, the SWAT team broke the glass on the back of that car with their armored car, but that uh, woman is now in custody. It's always good when someone is barricaded as far as no other people are involved. Uh, it's it's secure and we're able to take our time and that's what happened here. Now we still have not been told this woman's name. However, we do know Oklahoma Highway Patrol knows who she is. We're still waiting to get that uh, information into our inboxes. Live in Grady County tonight, Jason Berger, KOCO 5 News.